We must appreciate that the ban on the trade in rhino horn that was introduced by CITES in 1977 has simply not worked. And I say that with some degree of experience, having witnessed the results of the ban in different parts of Africa. Since the ban was introduced, 23 of the 33 countries that had rhinos in them have lost all their rhinos. They've gone. That is in spite of the trade ban. And let me give you an example of a country I worked in. I went to Zambia in 1965, and when I left the Luangwa Valley in 1970, the Luangwa Basin alone had 4,000 rhino. The trade ban came in, and in spite of that, 20 years later, all the rhinos in that reserve had gone. The wave of poaching then moved south through Zimbabwe and it reached South Africa in about 2008. And from 2008 till today, some 8,000 rhinos have been killed in South Africa alone. Now, that is in spite of the trade ban. Nobody can tell me that the trade ban has worked. It has not. It's been a failure. The only people who have benefited from the trade ban are the illegal criminal syndicates who are making all the money. Nothing is going back to those who are responsible for looking after the rhinos in the field. <laughs>